In this video, we'll show you how you can pair your Garmin GPS Map 66 to your smartphone and use Garmin Connect to sync up activities and other stuff. So let's flip over to the smartphone and show you how to get started. All right, here we are on our smartphone. We're going to open up Garmin Connect and we will do two things. One, make sure Bluetooth is turned on. And second, make sure we're not currently paired with other devices such as a Forerunner or a Phoenix. I had trouble pairing until I turned that off and then I could pair the 66, no problem. So let's click on more here at the bottom and find Garmin devices. And here we see our list of current devices. We're gonna tap add devices at the bottom and we're going to wait until this uh, kicks out because by default, it will search for a Phoenix or a Forerunner. It won't find the 66 in this round. We have to go through it to this screen and click at the bottom to see all compatible devices. And here we see the GPS map series, and then we can find the 66. And now we can start by getting the device into pairing mode. So let's flip over to our map 66, go under setup, and Bluetooth right here and hit enter. And since this is the first time, we'll have the screen, we'll hit continue, and we are now have the device into pairing mode. Back to our Garmin Connect, now we can see the device, and we can add this just like any other Bluetooth device. We'll see the little pin number, we should see the number on the device, and it's gonna do the pairing initialization. And at this point, Garmin Connect will start to do its own little synchronization and configuration. This will take a few minutes to do. And once you go through this wizard where you have to turn on locations and all that stuff, you may not have the exact same screens, but at this point you should be able to finish the synchronization process. And the screen should change on your Garmin 66 once you're all done. And you should be kicked back out to the main screen and you can see now the 66 is low, icon is at the top. And that's about it, all we need to do at this point. If we want to review the settings on our device, we can go to the Bluetooth settings and we can turn on and off uh, the status notifications. And if we want to remove the phone and start over again, we can go here and forget the device. Otherwise, that's about it.